Hello, I'm Terry Murphy. And I'm Barry Nolan, and this is Hard Copy for Monday, January 6th. Doug Bruckner has the latest on the Simpson trial in tonight's O.J. Rundown. Here are new photos shown to the jury today that made a plaintiff's attorney put his foot down about charges of fakery. The shots of O.J. in Bruno Mali's shoes come from a different photographer, not Harry Skull, whose very similar picture the defense labeled a fraud. Experts say the bloody shoe prints outside Nicole's condo were made by Bruno Mollies. But O.J. Simpson has denied wearing that rare brand, despite what the pictures appear to show. But the defense's photo analyst, Robert Groden, testified that the new pictures appear to be as phony as skull shot. Groden, I believe to an overwhelming degree of certainty that these are fake. The photo analyst's qualifications are being challenged, though. L.A. talk show host and attorney Bill Handel has grilled Groden. He is very presentable. He is very credible. He has a very pleasing personality. One-on-one, -on -one, he has a lot to offer. Unfortunately, his professional credentials are non-existent. What he is is an amateur. He is up against forensic photographers who have degrees, who have spent a lifetime studying photographs with appropriate equipment, and credibility-wise, I think he's going to have a very tough time in front of the jury. The new pictures were submitted just before New Year's from the files of Buffalo freelancer E.J. Flammer. One was published in a 1993 Bills football magazine. Simpson's attorneys objected to the jury seeing the pictures. Quote, it's highly suspicious that the photos have surfaced at this time. O.J. Simpson could get his say on the shoes when he returns to testify. That will probably happen at the end of this week.